okay uh, now we learn an another type of hierarchical clustering which is uh, very popularly known as birch b i r c h and uh, the full form of uh, this algorithm is balanced attractive bridging and clustering using hierarchies and this is a very popular hierarchical clustering algorithm which is widely used to for large data set and this algorithm is also used for to remove the inability of uh, previous hierarchical algorithm uh, to when a step is performed split or merge then we uh, not undo, uh, undo uh, this step but in batch algorithm this in, uh, inability is not uh, 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 in, is not uh, here uh, the batch algorithm is uh, working in two phase okay now in the first phase we perform the hierarchical clustering over the data set and uh, we uh, and, and and construct a, a clustering feature tree or cf uh, tree uh, with using some clustering features okay it is an uh, it is a type of height balance or b plus type of tree uh, that stores the clustering features informations about clusters cluster features or Uh, information about clusters okay and in the uh, second phase we apply a selected clustering algorithm any type of clustering algorithm to cluster the leaf node of the of the cf tree these leaf node are generally like as a noise okay uh, this is the second phase so overall clustering algorithm of uh, algorithm wilch uh, is Uh, working in two phase okay now what is uh, clustering feature uh, clustering features is a three dimensional vector which hold the information in such that uh, uh, n which is a number of data uh, uh, number of points or object in a data set ls which is the linear sum of all n points or objects ss that means Square sum of all n points or data set. Okay, now what is uh, how we calculate ls e uh, ls equal to uh, equal to i equal to one to uh, summation i equal to one to n x i that is the sum of linear sum of all n points and ss is equal to summation i equal to one to n x i whole square that means square sum of all n data objects or point. okay uh, and some other uh, uh, information also is used in clustering feature that means diameter of a uh, uh, cluster which uh, which formula uh, formulated as uh, under rule summation i equal to 1 to n summation j equal to 1 to n x i minus x j whole square divided by n into n minus 1 okay here x i and x j are two point uh, belong to the uh, cluster ci similarly radius of the cluster is calculated as some uh, under root uh, summation i equal to 1 to n x i minus x 0 uh, x 0 is a centroid okay it is a centroid x i minus x 0 whole square divided by n what is the what is n total number of data points or objects And now uh, uh, calculate a uh, centroid as such summation i equal to uh, one to n x i divided by n. Now uh, uh, and another uh, uh, concept uh, in Birch algorithm is also used when we have suppose we have uh, two cluster uh, C one and C two uh, with clustering features n one comma l s one comma s s one. and uh, uh, clustering feature for uh, uh, cluster c2 is n2 comma ls2 and uh, ss2 and these two clusters are disjoint clusters so we merge them in and form a new cluster let's uh, say c3 then the clustering feature of this uh, cluster 3 is calculated as equal to n plus plus n2 comma ls1 plus ls2 comma ss1 plus ss2 uh now we uh, go for a uh, an example suppose we have three points uh, in a cluster c1 and these points are 2 5 uh, 3 2 and 
and 43. Then we calculate the clustering feature of this uh, uh, cluster C1 as n that means number of points is 3. So, uh, so here we put 3 comma ls1 that means linear sum of these three points this is uh, calculated as 2 plus 3 plus 4 comma 5 plus 2 plus 3 and then uh, ss that means square sum of these uh, points uh, calculated as 2 square plus 3 square plus 4 square comma 5 square plus uh, 2 square plus 3 square and which is uh, finally uh, get the values um, 3 comma 9 comma 10 this is ls and SS is uh, 29,38. Suppose we have an another cluster C2 with the clustering feature CF2 uh, equal to 3, comma, LS is 35,36 uh, and uh, with SS is uh, 417, comma, 440. Now we mul uh, and these two clusters are disjoint. Suppose these two clusters C1 and C2 are disjoint and then merge them into a single uh, cluster which is C3. Now we find the clustering feature of C3 such as 3 plus 3, okay, 3 and 3. So 3 plus 3 comma LS1 uh, plus LS2, LS1 plus LS2. Similarly, so uh, LS1 is 35 and 9 and 10 and 36. So we uh, plan 9 plus 35 comma 10 plus 36. And then SS1 plus SS2, so uh, 29 plus uh, 417, comma, uh, 38 plus uh, 440. So we finally get the value uh, 6, which is N, comma, LS3, that is 44, comma, 46, and SS3, that means uh, squared sum of this uh, uh, clustering uh, uh, features uh, ZF3, uh, uh, 446, comma, 478. Okay, now uh, what is the disadvantage of this uh, Bilch algorithm is uh, like uh, other hierarchical clustering is also support spherical shape cluster. But uh, for arbitrary shape or non spherical uh, shape cluster, it is not suitable. Okay, uh, this is Bilch algorithm. Okay.